Can't find the dipstick on a car? It might have an oil level sensor instead. We're going to find out how they work next. This video is brought to you by Standard, manufacturer and distributor of engine management products for 100 years. Visit standardbrand.com for more information. Oil level sensors have been used on import and domestic cars for more than a decade. Some of the first applications only monitored if the oil level was low, using a switch attached to a float. The sensor would just trigger a message or light in the instrument cluster and only measured oil levels when the engine was not running. Modern oil level sensors can measure the oil level while the engine is running. Some sensors use an electrical resistance method as less of the sensor is covered by oil, the resistive value of the sensor changes. Newer ultrasonic sensors have a piezoelectric transducer which sends ultrasonic pulses into the oil and receives echoes from the oil surface inside the sensor's body. This information is sent to the ECU and data like engine speed and temperature is used to determine the dynamic oil level. The ECU can then alert the driver to add more oil if the level is low. Mercedes-Benz was one of the first automakers to start using oil level sensors in the early 1990s. BMW followed suit when it started to use the sensor in 1998 on select engines and eventually implementing it on all models. Volkswagen started using oil level sensors on most 2006 and up engines. Even Subaru has used oil level sensors starting in 2010. Domestically, oil level sensors can be found on certain 1998 to current GM vehicles, particularly those with LS V8 engines. So, no dipstick? No problem. I'm Jason Stahl. Thanks for watching.